Hello everyone, Scotty here from Blue Coconut Family and welcome back to another Railcraft example. So before I start the video, um, I'm going to do something that was suggested to me in the comments. So um, if I bring up Line 0237's comment, Hi Blue Coconut, you should comment a shout out, where you shout out a few random comments. Smiley face. So yes, that's exactly what I'm going to start doing. So thank you Line 0237, or however you want to say it. Let's do another one. Um, this is from Guru Drac. Good video to start my day with. Thank you. Another good one could be subways. Keeps mobs and players off tracks just as easily as monorails. Awesome. So what have I done for you, Guru Drac? I've gone away and I've done exactly that. So welcome today to my video. We're going to be looking at subways. So this isn't actually a working example per se, whereas my monorail kind of was a working example. I want to do more of a building example and just as um, Guru Drac said um, have a way to show you that we can keep mobs off tracks because that's a massive problem having you know middle of the night zombie walks across the track if it's electric it might start getting electrocuted and die but often if you've just got carts and stuff going around they get caught in your carts and that means when the car comes into your base you've got a zombie in the middle of your base and it's not, not good so monorails um, like we saw over there is a good example. The other one, as I'm going to show you today, is subway. So um, here I've built a very good example. So I've used a couple of materials and stuff. So I've used uh, quarried stone. I've used also um, concrete and stuff from a, um, a mod called Road Stuff, um, and a couple of bits like lighting and stuff from uh, Project Red as well. Um, so I've modelled this after the uh, London Underground way because I am British and me when someone says underground or subways I think London Underground yes hot sweaty small compact never on time uh, quite old needs to be updated and white and red yes that's the thing I think of when I think of London Underground but of course on the top if anyone has been to London and seen the underground you know that on this on this surface level you kind of got this little bit with little arc bit which in the middle here you would have the underground logo and what station you're on so we can come down here and uh, we go down the steps, deep underground, and we've got this kind of subway tile effect, which is the quarried stone brick, which is quite cool, which is actually part of Railcraft, so it looks really, really nice. And then you actually come into the main platform here. So you can see you've got the police down behind the, uh, the line paint on the uh, thing. Uh, this is part of the road stuff mod. This is a concrete block with shifted yellow line. And then these are just concrete block from road stuff. Um, I've also got some concrete from chisel, just to add that kind of basalty, kind of dark ballast underneath. Uh, I've also got the project red, red lamps around, um, and I've also darkened the tunnel with some extra utilities, uh, lapis um, shellitis, not black black material. Um, just so it looks like it goes off into foreverness. But this is a great example, guys. So if you wanted a cool bait, um, cool kind of um, train station for underneath your base, this is something you can do. So this is all. This is is just an example for you guys to go away and build your own, and then I can see and then I can see exactly what you're doing and how we can adapt it together. So this is really awesome. This is exactly what I've done. So what I've done as well is I've got my electric locomotive, which I've painted, like I said before, in the white and red, so it looks like the London Underground. And I've got the uh, carts underneath, uh, underneath, uh, behind, to be able to pull people around the uh, track, which is really quite cool. Uh, and it's themed after the London Underground um, train, which is really cool. Um, so yeah, this what this can do is can link a couple of bases. So if you uh, maybe if you are playing a multiplayer and you've got your friend on another base, you can connect your two bases together using this um, track, and you can have subway stations or underground stations underneath your base, and you can go down to it. And catch a train over which looks really cool it also if you light your tunnel it stops mobs getting onto the track um just just what um, guru Drac said which is quite cool um another thing uh, which is really quite cool is uh you can also use this as a way of getting around your mines and stuff as well so if you've got a secondary base where you may have your mining operation so it's quite deep down in the ground this would be a great way of getting you know from your base down to your mine you'll be using this. Um, so yeah, that's pretty, pretty much it for me today. So it's been very useful. Um, of course, guys, 
all this is is just inspiration for you guys to go away and build it yourself i'd love to see what you guys do so please post on to um, our facebook page uh, the blue coconut family we have a twitter at coconut family um, go like us and you know follow us on those um, also guys small little plead i hate doing this but we have just started off a patron um, and so if you do like our videos and you are a subscriber and such and you want to want to support us go away and become one of our beloved patrons um, it's all it is is a small monthly donation to us to help these videos going uh, and such so yeah it's just a small little thing if you like the video of course hit a like if you like any other videos in our um, in our channel hit that subscribe button you'll be the first person to know when the next one comes out so for myself Scully and the rest of the Blue Coconut family I'll see you in a couple of days bye